U.S. troops now participating in military exercises with their Romanian counterparts, while French and British troops deploy to Estonia. It's all part of a new NATO pivot towards the eastern flank hoping to integrate forces as a means to counter Russian aggression. We're showing some of our air defense capabilities. Uh, we're integrating with different units uh, and just uh, simulating a beach assault. They're absolutely amazing. And it's, it's great to get um, knowledge on their, their amount of skills that we don't have. But any response from NATO could be stalled by a new dispute between two powerful NATO allies, with Turkey accusing the German government of behaving like Nazis towards some Turkish citizens in Germany. The purpose of the Turkish swipes is to objectify, break every taboo with no regard to the suffering of those who are persecuted and murdered under Nazism. Another complication, Russia's announcement on Monday of a new military base in northern Syria, in territory controlled by U.S.-backed Kurdish forces, who Turkey views as an enemy. The move could drive a wedge between Turkey and the West, at a time when the Trump administration is seeking unity in the fight against ISIS. It's not news that uh, NATO and that the United States is looking for a commitment by all NATO allies. The Turkish government also saying on Monday that its forces were ready to take part in an offensive to retake Raqqa, the self-proclaimed capital of ISIS, if U.S.-backed Kurdish forces did not take part. In London, Benjamin Hall, Fox News.